hey kind friends welcome back and welcome if you're new boy oh boy have i got a sweet dollar tree haul for you it is a doozy it's a collective haul composed together of multiple trips to the dollar tree so if you care to see all the goodies i was able to score in these few trips then all you have to do is keep right on watching So clearly the volume of my haul outweighed my little dish bin here. So I had to kind of separate it into two different uh, units here. And I'm going to try to go through it pretty quickly because I don't want to take up too much of your time. Some of the things are multiple, so it looks a lot more serious than what it is. And I am just going to haul this so that I can put everything away because it was a couple of trips that I purchased the things and so I've had it sitting around for a couple of days. So for starters, in one of the trips that I went into the Dollar Tree, I actually went in for just some uh, dish soap and duct tape and I ended up getting into trouble as per usual. So I like when Dollar Tree puts out the 25% uh, more free. This is the limited time and um, you know, I'm pretty loyal to my palm olive, especially the original scent. These are my two go-tos, the palm olive and the Dawn dish liquid whenever I go into the Dollar Tree. So if I can get a bonus buy, yes, please, I'll take it with me. So I picked those two up. And then, like I said, I went in to get uh, dish soap and duct tape. And so I needed some duct tape for a project. And so I picked up uh, three rows and that was that. And then... Um, I found these, uh, they're called smokestacks, and these are turkey. It's actually turkey jerky with cheese, the little turkey sticks. So I purchased two packs to uh, give them a try. I also purchased this little measuring cup. It's just a plasticky four cup measuring count. And I needed another one, so I grabbed this one as well. So then in the hair care section, I grabbed a couple of packs of scrunchies, and these are a three-piece pack and they're just your basic black but I like the material it's so soft and silky so I picked up one and one for a backup because you could never go wrong with black and speaking of black I also picked up the head wrap in the solid black because it, during the summer you know sometimes I like to wear my hair up and keep my uh the little strays away from my eyes so I don't sweat so I grabbed that um, I found this little embroidery needle bundle and down the crafted square aisle and it's just a little cushion embroidery thing that you wear on your wrist. It has the little elastic -y wrist strap so that when you're sewing you can put your push pins on there and keep them in place. Also grab this car air freshener and the Hawaiian breeze scent. I only grabbed the one because they had other scents but that was the only Hawaiian one and that's my favorite scent. I grabbed this drop cloth because I've been working on a couple of house projects and I needed this to protect my floors. I'm sorry this is not in any particular order. It's kind of all over the place but that's just the way I roll. Sorry. Um, I actually picked up three of these Craftwise chalkboard paints. Now these are a buck 25 each sold individually but it you know, I just grabbed it like this because it was in the pack. And while I was down that aisle, I also picked up an extra pack of some little paint brushes because I have tons of paint brushes. But these little small ones, sometimes they come in handy. Then down the candle aisle where all the candles and the home decor is, I found these cute little jars they kind of look like amber glass and they have a little cork stop on it with this little charm detail that says live laugh love on it they're both the same so i picked up the two down the beauty aisle i grabbed a couple of bottles of nail polish remover one is regular and one is a hundred percent acetone uh, the regular is good for like um, acrylic nail tips or the fake nails and then the 100% acetone is best for your own natural nails. So I always grab uh, one of each because also I use the 100% uh, acetone a lot of times on crafting projects because ex it works excellent to take away wordings on certain uh Dollar Tree decor, so I love that. Then down the baby aisle, I found these cute little uh, baby washcloths by Angel of Mines. 
So I just picked up these two uh, patterns because they had a lot of uh, blue colors in it. I grabbed that and then down that same aisle I found some little baby onesies. I never seen uh, onesies in Dollar Tree before so I picked up this cute little blue one and a white one because why not? These are perfect for little add-ons to baby shower gifts and a lot of things i'm planning on making a decal on those so i grabbed it um down the same aisle where i found uh these little decor bottles i found this cute little plaque that just says bunny bait fresh carrots i'm kind of done with the uh uh easter decor already but i couldn't pass this one by for my tea tray i kind of love it just as is i'm not gonna doctor it up until after uh, Easter so I kind of love that it says bunny bait on it so I grabbed it for my tea tray I also grabbed one of these headbands I'm going to use it to put inside of an Easter basket that I'm putting together so I just picked up the one I like that it has like a little tie-dye vibes to it and so I'm really feeling those vibes and I grabbed the one also in with the Easter decor they had these cute little uh I wouldn't call them a basket exactly. It kind of looks like a a little shopping bag, but this is what it looks like on the inside. And then it has the little car, the truck or car, whatever you want to call it with the egg. I just thought it was so cute. Perfect to put like small little things in. So I grabbed two, one and one for a backup, just in case. I don't quite know what I'm doing with it just yet. Then down the tool bench aisle, I grabbed some of these um, self-adhesive hooks because this one says that they're both um, three pounds actually. So the clear ones come with four and then the white ones come with two. And I had grabbed these on one of my trips and then the next time when I went to another Dollar Tree, I found the original command hooks and I grabbed some of these instead because um, I've been purchasing these for a while at Dollar Tree because you know they're convenient but honestly these have been damaging my walls they haven't really been staying up the way that they're supposed to and when I try to take them off they kind of peel up the paint and leave some damage so I decided to go with the original command strip brand also in the beauty section i just picked up two nail polishes this trip and these are by la colors and la colors doesn't usually mark the uh, names of the color it's just usually a number and i don't have my glasses on right now so it's just this purpley lavender shade and then this one is kind of like a nude plum shade so i just grabbed the two this is a repeat purchase this is a usb car charger and this is by the uh brand iPlanet. this is a name brand i bought um one before and they're pretty good so i highly recommend them and i grabbed another one i also picked up a pack of these lithium button uh batteries because these are the kind that my uh scale uses so i grabbed that a repeat purchase for me are the pain relief um acetaminophen these are very comparable to the uh extra strength tylenol and i use them all the time not not a problem with them at all so i grabbed them then i even though i said i was already done with purchasing easter decor these were the, i had to grab these signs because they were on my wish list the only thing on my wish list going in were these signs and the uh, beaded garland which i did not find i still have yet to get my hands on the beaded garland but i'm happy that i was able to get this sign that says cotton tails pick your own carrot patch i love it this just screams me and it lends itself to my decor it has the the farmhouse vibes with the buffalo check pattern and the bunnies it's just i love it and speaking of loving it i picked up these two as well these look so vintagey to me i just really really love they read dollar tree really did their thing this year with the uh easter signs i love the little scallop detail on it i love the size of it i love that it's black and white i love everything about it so there are two versions this one says bunny trail farms east 
Acon's Daily, 25 cents a basket. And this one says, Happy Easter on it. Cottontail Farm, fresh eggs. And they both hang by the uh, little jute cord there. So I had to grab those. And then these are a repeat purchase. These came out uh last year and so they restocked them again this year but i've done a couple of diys here on my channel using these uh little cutting boards so i figured i pick up two more and this one just says uh fresh carrots locally grown 25 cents each cottontail farms 100 percent organic and this one says cottontail farm co egg farm and hippity hop lane one mile ahead and all that good stuff so that's one basket down one more to go guys so we're getting down to the wire so in this other little small basket this was something totally new that i have never seen in years past at the dollar tree this was totally new this year and their little bottle brush oh why did i say that bottle brush tree carrots that's a mouthful say that five times fast so anyway there are two pack of these little like a almost like a rusty burnt orange color bottle brush carrot with the uh, raffia bow on top and the little green sprig i just thought these were really cute just to you know simply place in a tea tray or on any kind of vignette so i grabbed those two packs and then and the beauty aisle, I grabbed some of these uh, Ioni individual lashes. These are the 3D curly ones, the uh, foam ink lashes by Ioni. I love them, so I grabbed two packs. Also, Kiss, they had, uh, Dollar Tree had the Kiss brush on uh, glue again. So I grabbed two because even though I'm giving my natural nails a break and I'm letting them breathe uh once in a while, I like to throw on a fresh set, so I like to have them as a backup. Um, I also grabbed this uh, Bolero brand uh, Cleanse and Hydrate. This is in the uh, mango and raspberry seed oil. These are facial wipes. Um, I like these. This is a 32 cal. I'm not too crazy about the Bolero project, uh, products as far as, you know, their lotions and stuff and their shampoos. They're usually watered down, but the uh, facial wipes are my favorite by far. But speaking of lotions and creams and stuff, I did pick up this after shower uh, whipped body cream by Bolero only because of its cute packaging. It kind of just, I'm a sucker for the packaging and anything watermelon. So this isn't a watermelon uh, beach rose, it says. That's the color, watermelon and beach rose, whatever that is. But I'm thinking that it probably smells amazing and it's just an after shower whipped body cream. So I'm eager to try that and see how it goes. Um, I grabbed one of these uh, LOL grab and grow little uh, fun activity pads here and it comes with two markers and it's just a little activity uh thing that you can do on the go with the kids i actually honestly picked it up to stick it inside an easter basket so i just got the one then speaking of easter baskets i've been trying to put together an entire easter basket without anything edible in it just you know kind of like novelty things and toys and stuff like that because the person that I'm making it for doesn't eat candy, but I couldn't resist these two little unicorn. They're like uh, lollipops. So they have the little button push up like that and it's a unicorn. So hopefully, you know, one lollipop is not gonna uh, do uh, that much damage. What kid doesn't like lollipops? So then I also grabbed this little pedicure set. It's a seven piece So you already know. I'm a sucker for the packaging and anything avocado, it's a wrap. So it's so cute. It has the avocado emery board and then it has this one too. It's the shape of an avocado. So I just thought this was so cute and I had to bring it home. Then um, this deodorant, I used to purchase it a lot at Dollar Tree and it has been... Uh, I want to say about a year or more that I haven't seen this doll de deodorant at the Dollar Tree. I thought they had discontinued it or something. And 
I was over it and then wouldn't you know I stumbled into one Dollar Tree and they had them again so I grabbed two I really highly recommend this one it's pretty good because it's an antiperspirant and a deodorant and it has 24 hour protection so this really does keep you dry so i grabbed two of them then i kid you not right now all of this haul is smells like this these are um this is a new item at dollar tree not to be confused with the unstoppables or the sand boosters it's called um odor defense it's a downy product with febreze in it and it's for odor defense and this stuff smells so good it's permeating right through the box i only picked up two boxes to give it a try but i can tell you right now on cold sniff through the box it has everything smelling wonderfully so i'm eager to give them a try then i also picked up this kiss gel polish and it's kind of like a lavender shade and it's uh, there's actually no name it's just some letters and a number they're changing it now every time i purchase a uh, nail polishes i used to love all their quirky little names they all uh kiss gel nail polishes always has these cutesy little names but this time around it's just letters and a number so i guess they're changing it up this is in a six fluid ounce size and it's a name brand leaping Le leopard so I figured, yeah, get in my cart. I'll take you home. Why not? And give it a try. And then um, I picked up, this is also for the same Easter basket that I'm putting together that I said that I was trying to just find things that are not candy related. So I picked up two of these uh, little magic towels and one is a uh, LOL surprise and one is Jojo Siwa what little girl doesn't like lol or jojo siwa so i grabbed one of each and these are to pop inside the easter basket along with this and a bunch of other stuff that i got then last but not least i picked up some of this uh spick and span everyday cleaner and this is the antibacterial cleaner and it says it kills the viruses and germs that cause COVID-19 and I am just a sucker for anything lemon scented especially in the spring and summertime yes please give me all the lemony stuff and then last but not least were these two little baskets this is a repeat purchase I love to purchase a uh, acrylic and clear like baskets you know and these are really cool and convenient because they have the handle so these are great for like pantries refrigerators underneath bathroom sinks you name it i have some organization of course we all probably do it spring is in the air and everybody's doing their little spring refresh and so why not utilize some simple dollar tree baskets and that's it guys that will conclude this haul i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you seen something that you like please comment down below let me know what was your favorite item that you seen today in this haul don't forget to like comment and share don't forget to subscribe and i'll meet you back here in my next video bye bye now